Well, hello folks. Well, it's uh, it's the night before the big reveal, the big fish reveal. And I still haven't started my fish. I haven't started my creation. I just I just don't know what to make. Well, I do. I've got to make a fish. But I mean, I've got to make something, you know, functional. Not an ornament. No, like, you know, a fish mobile chimes. Something go, you know, clang, clang, clang as the wind hits it. But, as, as, as in everything, you know, I sit here and, uh, and I say, uh, what have we got here? Fever tree. So I've got a gin and tonic. We'll have a little sip of that. And the idea hit me. Not literally, but uh, I'm just admiring the garden. We've put some lights up on the shed. We've got some well focus. We've got some lights on the fence. Uh -huh. And I've got these, I've got this like candle holder. This like little red little red ship's lantern you know and it holds a candle on that holder oh well, I had two there's the other one it's not got a holder and I thought that's it why don't I make a fish lantern holder so there it goes so there it is all the best ideas come just when you need it so I'm going to go into the shed in this glorious weather and uh, knock up a fish lantern holder. See you in a bit. Okay, well, I'll tell you now, I'm stuck. I've been collecting some parts. You know, uh, this is the, 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 the top of the fridge compressor motor. Some pipes out of that fridge compressor motor. I like these because they look like eyes, as do the bells off a uh, microwave controller. I've got some uh, wire reels off the uh, welding set, and I picked up some bike sprockets. And I think I've got a chain there as well. Uh, I've got a pile of scrap iron on the floor. I'm a bit, bit more of a bicycle there you know it's, I don't know I see kind of a, a squid in this but uh, do you know I've got a tis block so I'm just gonna play about with these you know I'm not gonna show you hours and hours of design because I've only got you know 15 minutes to show you this video and I've already taken five minutes up of it so da -da. Da -da. Ooh, I see a design here now uh, da -da. Da -da. the Loch Ness Monster oh yes I can see this now a Loch Ness Monster. That could be an eye. Oh, there we are. Huh. Uh, Going to do some designing. I've got an idea. I'm going to start off with uh, this. But I need it in half.
<laughs> Whose flaming idea was it to come up with a fish? Well, it, it was mine. Uh, well, I said it. I'm going to have to do it, Anna. Uh, how's that look? How's that look to you? Yeah. Mm. Oh, look at well, do you think that one just come about right there? Let's stick that there. I oh, need it. Okay, well it was supposed to be one piece, cut those sections off and it was supposed to curl round like that, of course it broke in half, <coughs> making the best of a bad job, oh it's warm that. Seems to me like this uh, jellyfish is taking place. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, okay. You figure, I know you figured out what it is already. But, so we've got the belly, got the tail, we've got a bit of a fin at the back. That's all, is that right? Hey, you need an head. I think we're getting there, but it's uh, it's nine o'clock on uh, Friday night, and we uh, we're doing it, revealing it live tomorrow. And I've just got to kind of figure out its uh, its head. Right, we've cut a piece of we just cut a piece of this tube off. I noticed there, but I've actually tapered it a little. So we go like that. 
And don't forget, we're hanging a lamp off this. I'm not sure. I'm not sure at all. Okay, we're. Uh, I think I'm happy with the uh, the body. Just got to figure the head. Well, I've had a look through my little tub, bits and pieces, things and funnels. You know, uh, uh, that didn't work. No, that didn't work. But what I did find, uh, I find this, but kind of like, no, like what I did find. Found this middle out of a jet wash pump. So if you can turn it just like that, and that can go in there as its eye. And then I found this adjustable TV stand or bracket. Now those faced outwards, so I've taken it to bits. I've also taken this uh, axle out of the end. And that is going to go like that. Somehow. Oh, maybe like that. Right, so the whole object of this is to be a lamp holder. I need a pole, which is got to go this way, like that. So, people of YouTube, with just three hours to go, I have finished my fish creation. Uh, I must thank Bagot Corner for the suggestion of uh, a challenge. All handmade for backing him up. Ubi Lions are uh, for egging them both on. And I can kick myself for suggesting a fish. Uh, Thanks everyone that's taken part. It has been some fun. Uh, more than anything, my wife likes it so it can stay in the garden. And it's got a name which I forgot, Ruby, Ruby, Ru Ruby Rose or something like that. Okay, the creation. As I said, it's going to be a lamp holder. And indeed, it fits the, uh, the bill just right it's a little higher at the moment than that one but the further i shove that pole in the harder it is it's going for me to pull out i'm a firm believer that less is more so i won't be embellishing it anymore like with little fins sticking out the side hope you've enjoyed this build